Hey what is up guys, welcome back to another video, today we're back and we're recording another FIFA 17 player review. Today's review is on the new, um, I don't even want to pronounce his name, so we're going to call him Platt. That is not his name though, and I'm not German so I'm not going to try to pronounce his name. Yeah, here's the team we do play uh, him in, um, also another two reviews there, as you can see Max Cruz and uh, Sully. Uh, Max Cruz is out already and uh, Sully will be out. Uh, two hours after this, 8 pm if you're watching. So yeah, make sure you do check out that too. So yeah, here he is, Marvin. Actually, we'll call him Marvin. So yeah, Marvin, uh, there. 65k paid for him, and he's going for about 55 to 60k. Five games, no goals, no assists. So yeah, he is a very defensive player, as you can see here from these stats. His He only has 73 shooting, 91 positioning, though, which is great for a defender. 84 pace, pretty bad really, uh, considering the other options. So yeah, 91 balance, 91 ball control, perfect though. 90 stand and tackle, which is insane for a uh, left back. Uh, 90 passing, 99 crossing, 98 free kick accuracy on a left back. A left back. Here he is here straight away with the ball out the wing. Just keeps the ball so tight to him, and he just. Slips past him, uses the strength there to keep the ball. Pass out to Cruz. And yeah, so that is uh, two of his things there. Uh, his dribbling, which I should input down of one of his pros. Should be. Yeah, more uh, his. Yeah, here he does play in. Uh, start up this attack, like, and his passing is amazing. You can see in the first two clips there, great passes. Here, they started an attack against us. Yeah, there he comes across, and he's great defending too. That's what you want. The stand and tackle and the sliding tackles are amazing. Didn't actually do many sliding tackles. But yeah, that stand and tackle there is uh, great. And that is one of uh, his main traits of his defending pro. But yeah, here. Makes a great block and then does another amazing stand and tackle. But yeah, we did have to pause the game there. Here now. Great work from the opposition here. But yeah, he just... Just keep it tight to the player, just waiting for the right time. Strengths him off the ball, and then uh, Sanchez does get in his way, though. So, yeah, going over his pros again. His stamina uh, is amazing, and he's just going to last you the full match, even a couple of matches. Uh, his passing, 90 passing on a full back. That's, that's higher than his defending. He's just going to be able to play it from the back, which is amazing. Uh, but, yeah, I should have put dribbling in there because his ball control, he keeps it so tight. And he just plays off them passes like as in the first clip there you can see he ran up the pitch, skinning through the players, holding them off with his great strength, which is also one of his pros. Yeah, he also defending there, but uh which is more or less his stand and tackle, it is insane as you can see throughout uh the highlights there. Yeah, he only has one pro and that is his pace. Um well comparing to other uh right backs uh and left backs in the Bundesliga there is well there's not very many high paced left backs, but there is right backs. But I think this guy is better than Alaba, and I would recommend him over Alaba. But yeah, really hope you enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching, and of course, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.